in LA, there is a project uh, called Downtown Crenshaw. Can you tell us just a little bit about that? Okay, well, the Downtown Crenshaw uh, project is about uh, cooperative housing mostly. Um, the, what's happening is that there's a uh, iconic um, mall in uh, South Central Los Angeles called the Crenshaw Mall. And there's a, several uh, private equity firms that have been trying to purchase that. And what they you know, wanna do is they wanna uh, transform it into high-end, uh, very expensive housing, uh, high-end housing uh, for Los Angeles. This is uh, you know, the process of gentrification. So in South Central, the African-American community is probably one of the largest African-American communities uh, in you know, this part of the country, uh, but it's dwindling because of gentrification. And so the community has uh, grabbed onto this, um, this particular uh, situation with the Crenshaw Mall is, is extremely symbolic. Uh, and uh, they are attempting to um, raise the funds and the financing to, they've actually put in a bid and they've confronted uh, several um, private equity firms, the uh, CIM group, uh, which is somehow connected to the Kushner group, um, you know, has its ties to the Trump administration. Uh, and then after that, an organization called Live Work, which also has ties to the Kushner group. So um, they have um, organized, uh, community organizing to resist this, this buyout by these, this private equity firm and the transformation of this housing into high-end housing, expensive you know, housing, and they want to purchase it and remodel it so that they have affordable housing. So it's mostly about cooperative housing, but I did want to um, talk about cooperative housing in general as key, not just cooperative housing, but cooperative ownership of a commercial real estate as well as key to this movement. Um, we, you know, the workers that work in worker cooperatives have to be able to afford to live near the worker cooperative. So the cooperative housing is extremely important. Um, and then the commercial spaces, um, I believe that, that every time a worker cooperative sets up a business plan that they should have in their business plan, uh, a, a plan to purchase the facility will they, they, which will be their workplace. Uh, so cooperative ownership of the land is key to the success of the movement of the worker cooperative movement. So the uh, worker cooperative um, will be in the first floor of downtown Crenshaw. They, the community organization downtown Crenshaw has asked us to uh, you know, help out by developing worker cooperatives. It will be on the first floor, but the upper two floors are gonna be converted to um, affordable housing uh, if they manage to purchase this mall, which is, uh, you should go to downtowncrenshaw.com and forward slash petition, sign their petition because this is how we've been uh, working to, uh, to you know, fend off the, uh, these uh, big investment uh, private equity firms that have been attempting to um, gentrify South Central and push out the African-American community. I will definitely put that in the closing credits as well as uh, in other sources too, where you can see that and get that. Thank you so much.